Hey guys, Logdog321 here, and uh, I got a request to make a video about the attachments on the Shark Navigator Liftaway. Rotator. Professional. Insert adjective here. Amazing. Best vacuum ever. Magic unicorn. No, just kidding. Um, yeah, as you can tell, I don't really like the name. I think it's way too long, and I say that every video, and I'm sure you're tired of me saying that by now, but that's beside the point. Anyway, attachments. So stored on the vacuum, you have this, which is, they call it the multi-tool. It has the uh, brush on it. But then also, you can press and slide, just like on some of the Dyson vacuums. It's obviously took a little bit of inspiration from Dyson. We have that. Next up, we have the crevice tool. This is also stored on the machine itself. Now, the crevice tool has this little button here. You push it and it looks like a clown coming out of mini because it just keeps coming. And there we go. Double length. Let me retract it so that I can fit it in the shot. Next up we have the turbo brush. And uh, it's pretty good. It is a uh, standard shark turbo brush. One of the better ones. Uh, Dyson is the only one who's ever made a better turbo brush on a consumer vacuum, in my opinion. That's not uh, a specialty vacuum. But um, and then the last really big floor or attachment is the uh, hard floor tool. Now uh, it has brush strip that you can engage by pressing the foot pedal. There you go, brush strip comes up. This is designed so that you can use the machine in uh, canister mode, so with the little with it following you around on the caddy. And then uh, last thing for tools is it does come with the detailing kit, which I actually review the whole kit in another video. So yeah, that is the attachments that come with the Shark Navigator Rotator. And uh, I hope you enjoy the video. If you have anything else you guys want to see, please don't hesitate. Rate, comment, subscribe, let me know in the comments section. I will get back to you. Thanks. Have a great day.